Todd Barcy here, and today is January 3rd, 2022. I'm in Madison Heights, Michigan, at the Meyer store. And this Meyer looks like the ones I imagine you do across the uh, 253 or whatever stores they, mega stores that they have in uh, I think five states. Um, they all probably have something similar to this displayed. And we found this as a, a pattern, uh, you know, throughout many months and um, a lot of painstaking effort. Uh, we've learned how to detect these type of things and we see why they're being, you know, allowed to continue and kind of uh, part of a, you know, a bigger scheme to elicit profits out of these sections and stimulate growth and sales and you know, the whole marketing stuff that results in people being misled here. They're being tricked. So, um, I got a lot of soapboxing on that. I'm gonna try and be brief here. This is what I'm purchasing. If you came up to this, you'd think, buy two, get $2 off instantly. I mean, we've beat this to death. So, um, they've seen it for a long time. I'm gonna make a purchase on these and uh, say this uh, combination, this Meyer daytime cold and flu there should be no reason um, we've looked at this with a microscope no reason that a person wouldn't presume that this is part of that promotion so um, we'll just see how they handle it here and if they're gonna keep violating it we're just gonna you know keep recording these incidents and uh, show that these are victims out here that are real people and they've got their carts full of stuff um, no doubt that are lies and so anyway I'm gonna go through check out and we'll just check back in at the customer service hello, hello. how are you Good. so um, I didn't get the two dollars off instantly like it has in the uh, promotion uh, what are we talking um, about right down here the uh, cold and flu or the cough I got one of those and one of those it's got a sign right by it too I could show it to somebody um, it's I also took a picture because I you know yeah, um, but I wish somebody would fix it even if you fix it <laughs> You know what I mean? I just shouldn't have to wait and whatever. Do they have like a, um, a person that can look into that or anything? Yeah, or? I'll bring it up to them. Okay. Cause like, you know, it's bad enough we need this stuff right now. So, you know I mean? I don't, I'm, I know you're just a, you know, probably not able to do anything, but I would much rather than this two dollars have this fix. Okay, I will bring. I'll make sure it goes to the manager to bring it up to the pricing manager. Okay. Did you want to write down the UPCs? I just know that it's these, so I will make because if it's not working on those, it's fine. Well, what about everybody that buys them? Those signs are out there. We'll take care of it, sir. Heard that before. I okay. apologize. Okay, so that's no Michigan bonus on that, or? No, because it's a coupon that you didn't receive. So I gave you the coupon price. Right, and it you're didn't sure scan about in that? correctly. It was the right pricing. It was just not a coupon. It's a promotion that does not include Michigan Scan. Well, I wonder if the Attorney General will, will agree. I, I apologize. It, it was Bring it priced. up with the Attorney General, buddy. We're in line here. It was priced correctly. It was just Excuse an in-store promotion. It did not I got things to do. So that's why you're not getting it. It's, if it was, if it was um, priced like for five forty nine, we charge you six forty nine. Absolutely, we would give you the Michigan Scan Law, but that's not what it was. It was priced correctly. It was a promotion you didn't receive, so we fixed it for you All by right. giving you the promotion. Okay, well I'm gonna get bullied out of here anyway. So there you go. Have a good yeah. night. It pushes Enjoy me right. Enjoy the weather. You too, sir. Good luck on that ticket. Sorry about the hold up, everybody. So that's pretty typical. 
And if you don't see what people are up against with this, then you're missing it all. You know, uh, this is how they take advantage of people. This is how they unfairly compete. And this is how they clear those shelves. And uh, really, it's pretty gross and disgusting. And the whole thing really needs to be fixed by my If they want to make that part of their story. By the way, all these little fluffy phrases on the wall. You know, these, these little feel-good moments where they, you know, try and tell us that, you know, they don't know what they're doing. Uh, it just doesn't fly with me anymore. So anyway, uh, you know, we got it every which way. We're signing off in Madison Heights, uh, more of the same stuff. Thanks again for watching.